Oh, this is insane! This is- Oh my goodness! Oh my- Oh, guys! Oh, what? 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 Oh, look, it's like- Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back to another series. It's the start of, believe it or not, yet another survival series. So, what name should we call it other than Survival Series 3? Because I believe this is the third survival series we've done. Um... And yeah, we're just going to start fresh, see where we end up at. So hopefully this will be a bit more successful than Survival Series 1, which was called Survival Series. Survival Series 2 was called Survival Redemption, and that was to redeem ourselves from the failure in Survival Series 1. And now Survival Series 3 is to redeem the failures from Survival Series 2. So we're just going around in like one big continuous cycle. So this time we're going to survive. That's why I say we're going to survive. Uh, so yeah, we're gonna jump straight into it, see where we spawn, hopefully hopefully somewhere with like trees, hopefully a village maybe, other good stuff, I just noticed that's not quite on centre. Hopefully like trees, village, um, or something else, just watch me like spawn on some sort of survival island now, or something like that. But anyway, um, yeah, this series should be good hopefully, and anyway, we'll see what's in store. So yeah, we've spawned on a little island, and just let me grab all this. Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness, guys! What? Oh my goodness. So, uh, for those of you that don't know... What? This is incredible! For those of you who don't know, um, this is like one of the rarest biomes to find in Minecraft, let alone spawn in the middle of. Oh my goodness. We are actually... We're set. I know what you're thinking. You're thinking, what? But Matthew, there's no trees here. And we don't need trees. Literally, around this island, in this biome, you just get tons, and I mean absolutely tons, of um, wrecks, shipwrecks underwater. So, I guarantee within 10 minutes, we'll have like 10 iron ingots, a few diamonds, hopefully, emeralds. Oh, this is insane! This is. Oh my goodness! Oh my! Oh, guys! Oh, what? 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 Oh look, it's like maxing out right now! This is- I've never been lucky before! So this is like all my luck of my entire life that I should have had combining into one! There is an ocean monument right there! Am I just seeing this or is it actually there? Can you- What? There isn't- I don't believe that- Oh! I literally just don't believe this luck right now! Just- uh, we're gonna get hit by guardians if we go anywhere near that. Oh, what? This is like the most insane start to a series ever. So the other two really were failures, but just from the spawn of this, it's like I'm being told, this is the series, this is the one way you're going to get lucky. If finding one ocean monument and spawning in the rarest biome in the game isn't lucky, then I don't even know what is, because that is the definition of luck right there. That is the definition. If I Google the definition of luck right now, it will say spawning on a survival island in an ocean biome with like icebergs and a ocean monument. Oh my goodness! No! No way! No way! No way! Oh boy! Oh boy! Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! This is insane! Oh! Oh! oh. <laughs> This is unbelievable! Oh look, it's like, through the roof right now, there was a hole in my roof right now, and my luck has just like whizzed through the roof, because we have spawned on a survival island, in the rarest biome in the game, with not one, but two ocean monuments, all within about 300 blocks. Oh, what? What? This luck is unheard of! This luck is unheard of! Guys, oh my goodness, if you know anybody that's been lucky before, let them know that I am now luckier than them, because this is insane. And we've found a shipwreck, this is the first shipwreck, down we go, down we go. Let's just be careful to keep an eye on our oxygen supply, because we don't want to be drowning after such a lucky spawn. I mean, I haven't really got much to, oh my goodness, what a chest, what a chest. Uh, come on, go, 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 oh boy, oh boy, we're drowning, oh boy, oh no, 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 oh, we're up to the top. Never mind. So, I am freaking out right now. Oh my goodness. Right, just calm. Let's do some deep breaths. Oh my goodness. Oh, this is insane. So, yeah, as you can tell, this is a pretty big thing to happen in Minecraft. And like I say, the other two were failures. We had, like, absolutely awful spawn points, everything. 
just the rate of the first like uh, four minutes and 52 seconds of this series is gone. I know that this is going to be a successful series. I can feel it. I mean, who else do you know that has ever spawned in this biome with two ocean monuments next to them? In fact, in fact, I'm so lucky. I'm going to reveal the seed. So there's the seed negative 148 of 41, 4485. So you can go ahead and like play in this world if you want, because this is insane. I'm literally like shaking slightly right now, probably because my hand's hurting, but also just because I'm ridiculously hyper about this. Um, about this, this is insane. Oh my goodness! So we just need to calm down, and yeah, we <laughs> we might as well just end the series here and call it a success, because we've just got more lucky than the luckiest person ever. I think I should definitely buy a lottery ticket this week, because I reckon I'd win it with this luck. But, yeah, oh my goodness, there's the other ocean monument. Uh, ooh, anyway, calm, 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 calm. So yeah, ooh, kelp, we need some kelp. Always good to get some good kelp in your inventory. I think that's kelp, isn't it? Yeah, kelp. So, aside from the extremely good spawn point, we mustn't neglect the fact that we do still need to get stuff. We're already running low on food. And we could do with getting some better stuff in the um, department of things like, uh, oops, like we'd need a treasure maybe here. Oh, some armor. Don't mind if I do. Uh, there's nothing there. Oh dear. What's going on? I'm not even touching the keyboard right now. Oh my goodness, I'm not even touching the keyboard. I wasn't even touching the keyboard then. Anyway, down we go. Because there's definitely, how is there only one chest in this? How is there only one? Oh no, there's not, there's two. Buried treasure, yes! So we're gonna go and find this buried treasure. Oh no, 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 my oxygen's going, my oxygen! Oh no, we're taking it. Okay, we're fine. Uh, so we're gonna go ahead and try and get this treasure. Oh, I'm probably just gonna end up going on about how insanely lucky this is for the entire episode. Because this is luckier than luck. I'm the mayor of Luckville right now. Sitting before you is the mayor of Luckville. So, if this does happen and we do do well today, then you'll be watching this video. If it didn't, then, well, actually, you wouldn't know this video had happened, so, yeah, you wouldn't think anything else of it. But, yeah, I don't see how this can go wrong. I do not see how this can go wrong. Uh, we're just insanely lucky. Oh, my goodness, what? Oh, no, there's water. Okay. Uh, block that up real quick. Head back down, don't mind if I do. Uh, we could do with trying to find this buried treasure, because... Oh my goodness! D okay, there is something ridiculous with my luck right now. Th this is this is getting ridiculous! I don't like being this lucky! Why am I so lucky? Why is this happening to me? Why? So basically, whenever I find buried treasure, there's usually about a 10 block radius within, like, you see on this map, there's like a cross in the middle. That's usually about a 10, maybe 20 block radius of where that cross is, as to where the treasure actually is. And within destroying about four blocks, I managed to find it. Why is this water still here? I blocked you off. I blocked you off. Why are you still here? Nobody wants you here, water. Okay, okay, I'm actually, some people might in the world. I wasn't being disrespectful that people that do want water. I was just stating that at this point in time, I didn't want the wall. Oh my goodness, we've got a diamond. Oh boy, this couldn't have gone better if it had been all a different seed. I, I know, on the way in I was like, oh yeah, hopefully we'll spawn somewhere with a village. Hopefully get some, I can't even remember what else I said, some trees in a village, that was it. But why have trees in a village when you've got stuff like this? Why is my game so laggy right now? Um, but who needs trees in a village when you've got an infinite supply of ships, pretty much? Two... Uh, underwater monuments within about 300 blocks of your spawn and just endless amounts of buried treasure and other such stuff. This is insane. I just kind of need to keep an eye on my coordinates so that I don't stray too far away because back there I didn't screenshot it but I screenshotted the cords of the uh, two monuments so that we don't lose them. Oh my goodness, polar bear! I've never seen a polar bear in Minecraft before! This is my first time, never even in creative. I have never seen a polar bear before. Oh my goodness, can I feed him? Can can you tame polar bears? I'm gonna feed him some fish, here you go. Hey there, little guy. 
You want some fish? Uh, can, can I just throw them to you? Oh no, he's falling off. Oh. Yeah, come on. I'm trying to give you fish. Come on, take the fish. Take the- oh my goodness, no, he's attacking me! He's attacking- reverse, 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 reverse! Down, down, down! Battle stations, dive, dive, dive! Oh my goodness, he is infuriated with me! Right, so we need to do a sick maneuver. Reverse, reverse, reverse! Okay, go, 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 go! Oh my goodness, is he walking on water? Is he walking on water? Oh, oh my goodness, that was close. So, yeah, I did not know, but apparently polar bears are actually pretty aggressive animals. Uh, I should know that because I did actually really like polar bears when I was younger, but I somehow forgot that polar bears do not like being punched with a fish. I can't say I'd like being punched with it either, so I don't blame him, so sorry about that, dude. But anyway, uh, we need to just try and find some more stuff. Oh, boy. I think I, I just got a bit carried away at the start with how lucky we're being, and... Oh, my... No, 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 no. Come on. Oh, that was close. I need to be a bit more conscious of uh, oxygen, I think, when I'm underwater, because at the moment I'm suffering severe damage as I'm approaching the surface again. So yeah, I just need to keep an eye on that, but apart from that, we've got off to... I've never even got off to a better start in a creative world where I've used, like, a special seed or something. You know, this is the first time i found seeds similar to this by using a seed that I found online. But if you think there's like quintillions of different seed combinations I could have and just happened to be the one that I used that landed me here and there's like a one in, oh, it's a ridiculously large number chance that I would spawn in this location. And then if you factor in the fact that there's the factor of the fact of the two monuments being within 300 blocks of the spawn, then that means that there's like a, a 0, 0.00 and then if you can imagine me saying 0 a billion times a second for the next billion years and then a 1 after all those zeros, that is how many zeros there will be after the 0 for a chance of spawning here. Oh, there's another ship! Buried treasure, we're going down! We're going... Oh, I just dismounted perfectly, let me just put this... Curse of Vanishing! Who likes Curse of Vanishing? Oh, we, we've got some Blast Protection 4! And we're only... so... we've started... Just let me explain. For those of you who have just joined, or randomly come to like 12 minutes 45 seconds in the video, we've spawned in on an island in the rarest biome in the game, or one of the rarest biomes in the game. We have two ocean monuments within 300 blocks of spawn. Tons, and I mean tons of uh, shipwrecks underwater near the vicinity of our uh, spawn island, take the paper just in case, and yeah, um, we've now got blast protection for the helmet, oh my goodness, oh my goodness, no, 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 damage, 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 oh, and we've got blast protection for on the helmet, um, we've got curse of vanishing for some reason on the leggings, I don't know who likes curse of vanishing, but apparently whichever sailor was sailing that ship decided that he was going to leave them for me. But I don't plan on dying, so my aim is going to be to keep these uh, leggings for the entire, in, for the entirety of the series. Because basically, what happens is um, anything that is enchanted with Curse of Vanishing basically disappears if you die. So if I can keep these until the stage of trying to kill the Ender Dragon, which will hopefully be in about six or seven episodes' time then that means that I'll be set. Because, oh, what was... What was that? What the heck is that sound? I'm being attacked from something that I can't even see? I'm being assaulted from all angles right now. Go, go, go. I don't know what that noise was, but I did not like it at all. I did not like that noise. Okay, okay. Oh my goodness, that was pretty scary. So I'm just going to go ahead and do some off-camera searching for other loot for my inventory and I'll be right back with you guys in well for me it could be about 10 minutes but for you it will probably be about two seconds so guys not only have I just found some insanely cute turtles like mating on the shoreline here but now I can't get out of here but as well as this I've also found our first treasure of the four so I'm just gonna go over and open this treasure and then 
I shan't see you again until I've opened the other three that I've got on the maps. Oh, this is the best start ever, guys. See you in a minute. So we're back, guys. I just got to the final one. There's like some skeleton under there trying to shoot me through the water, even though that's impossible, kind of. And he's like just trying to commit suicide. So using the iron sword, I found on one of the various ships that I went to. I am going to take him out. And that's officially our first kill. Um, I was just looking because on the last ship I was on, I found a map. And I happened to... I could probably get rid of it now. I spotted this huge, huge ravine um, on the map. So we're just going to head over to that. Just check it out real quick. And take a look at it. Oh, it's here. So I think this could actually be a good place to start off. This could be a good first base for us. Uh, yeah, this, actually, it, it looks like a, a dead-end ravine, like this, like it's big, but there's not sort of anything there, so, oh, one thing we could do with doing is getting a bed, because so far I've had to just sail in my boat, oh, sorry, I, oh, I thought he was going down, uh, so yeah, that's pretty much all we've done, and I've just realised something absolutely insane, I don't know anybody who, else, who can say they've done this, we have, six, six, we have 70 iron, 48 emeralds, 2 diamonds, 13 lapis, 17 gold ingots, and we have not mined a single block with a pickaxe. We have not mined a single block yet. And it, oh my goodness, this is what I mean. Oh look, just keeps getting better and better and better in this episode. That's what I mean, it's, it's through the roof, it's now through the ozone layer. I've heard that the International Space Station has just had to change trajectory so that it doesn't collide with my luck. That is how high my luck has gone right now. So we've just found this desert temple, as well as the two monuments by spawn. This is insane! So, oh, I'm trying to decide. So, I think it's been quite a while, so... Uh, we're gonna leave this for next time. I'm gonna wrap things up for now. This is all the other stuff I managed to get throughout my adventures. Look at the various different ships I could find. Uh, but yeah, that, that's about it for this episode, guys, so thanks very much for watching. If you are still watching, then make sure that you like, comment, and subscribe, because if you've watched this much and you haven't got fed up with me, then clearly you need to be subscribed. Uh, make sure to follow me on social media, links are in the description below. And stay tuned for episode 2 of the most insane survival series ever. So see you later, guys. Bye! <laughs>